Hi everyone, it's Anne here from Anne Makes. Yes, it's me. Um, I just came out of the shower. My my hair is uh, still wet and I just decided I need to put all this stuff away. I have very little desk space left. And uh, yeah, so that's why I, you don't see my face today. Trust me, I just, I just got up, showered and all that. So I went to Dollarama yesterday and I found uh, some nice things and I wanted to share that with you. So here we go. By the way, if you are new to my channel, I would love it if you would uh, subscribe and you can do so by clicking on the subscribe button up below or on the Amex in the corner of the screen. And Please don't forget to click on the bell uh, until it moves so YouTube will know you would like to be notified whenever I post new content. Today I have a haul video. I have had a lot of haul videos all in a row lately. And I do have an organization video, craft room organization video coming up. I also have, or, it will, or you will see it before this one actually. I can't remember the order of my videos. There's just, there's, yeah, anyway, my videos are not coming out. Um, um, in sequence right now <laughs> sorry uh, so what I found uh, I was attracted to this 60 gift labels pad because of the station wagon with the Christmas tree and presents on top of it and this just made me think of Christmas vacation which is our favorite movie and the Griswolds and when they go looking for a tree although their car is blue but this one is red so uh it's i just thought this would be really appropriate to use as gift tags because last year i think i got some gift wrapping from another store that had the um the griswold christmas vacation movie theme on it and i just thought these would, tags would match really well with that so you get 60 pieces for two dollars i would like to open it to show you inside so here are some of the tags. Some of them are very um, just classical. There's a lot of glitter. There's gold and see here's the the card. There's the squirrel and I just remember if you remember the part in the movie with the squirrel that is so hilarious. So yeah and there's a lot of gold in this one. I didn't realize that but you know uh, there's a lot of pretty pretty stickers and yeah so I got that. Some other tags that I picked up, I thought these were really cute and they might be good to use in crafting as well as gifting. The There's only three in here, three gift tags, and they are very thick chipboard. I just thought they were well made. I like the sayings on them. I just think they're really cute. And the three of these are $1.50. I went back to pick up some more of these giant tags. Uh, I've had lots of ideas given, shared with me by viewers, and I appreciate all of those ideas that you've shared with me. So I got, I went back to get more of these large gift tags. There's a six in here in each package. It's a dollar twenty-five per package. This is what they look like. Something that was is new to me are the stemware tags and you get 18 pieces in here for a dollar so basically they are a circle with a slit cut into them they seem to be in red and silver and the idea is that you would write the name of your guest on this little tag and so everybody could remember which of which glass is their glass when everybody starts drinking too much. <laughs> anyway, so I picked these up. They're, they look like little ornaments. I thought there might be some other paper crafting possibilities with these. And, you know, I get 18 of these for a dollar, so why not? Um, we'll try that. This is not a new item, but this is the kitty collar that Snowball wears and uh, we try to replace it every year because you know she's been wearing it for a long time so this is uh, the kitty collar that she wears it's got the red with the flowers and it's got a little bell and it's a dollar twenty-five 
I picked up these packages of lead refills for mechanical pencils. I thought it was a good buy because you get one, two, three, four, you get five packages of lead refills. Each package has 12 LEDs, so you have a total of 60 LEDs. These are the HB in 0 0.5, and they also had them in 0 0.7, and since I have mechanical pencils of both sizes, I thought I'd pick up one of each of these. And so you get these 60 LEDs basically for $2. So I thought that was a pretty good deal, and I wanted to have these in my office supply stash. I saw these pretty trays and they have so many lovely designs currently. Uh, I really liked this one. So I got that. It, I like how it's, it's long and it's a bit shallow and it has handles so I can carry things in it. And this tray was $3. And I got this one. Uh, this one, this one is longer. I don't know if it fits on camera. It's much longer it's very narrow and thin. I don't have anything like this uh, in my, all my Christmas platters and such so I thought I would pick it up and I, I love the design I love the reindeer and the trees on here and so I got that one this one is also three dollars so they're just really cute trays to use during the holidays for you know presenting foods and snacks uh, speaking of uh, tableware for speaking of tableware for the holidays, I got two of these platters. They're divided platters, and these are great for putting, of course, vegetables and dips, or other kinds of munchies and whatever. You can even make a, pl a fruit platter out of this and put some yogurt in the center. Uh, there's, you know, you could do healthy things and you can do junk food things. I also think these are great. Um, divider trays to use in the craft room when you're working with lots of little items and you can just use the tray to hold all your little little crafting goodies all your different supplies so you've got five compartments in here and yes you can put a lot of stuff in here or a lot of good goodies to eat so these are a dollar fifty and they're just a uh, clear acrylic well, transparent colored acrylic. My store has them in uh, red and green. Picked up a couple of gift boxes, tiny little gift boxes. Uh, I thought these would be great. They're called money holder boxes and that's exactly what I wanted these for, to put money in for gifts. These are $1.25 each and they open up like this. They, I like the they have like this magnetic closure too so I just thought it was a nice way um, to give someone a gift of some cash uh, versus you know but just putting it in an envelope so I got a couple of those I got a new toy for uh, for a snowball Santa will be bringing her this at Christmas it's a little shark and it's has that crackly thing in it so I, I think she'll like it she'll probably fling it around the house a few times and play with it uh, so this little shark is two dollars and fifty cents so we got that for snowball a new item uh, not well, I guess you could use it as docking stuff for if you wanted to but I thought it was a good buy uh, in the hardware section they had these little boxes by duramax and duramax is the the brand that they use for dollarama anything having to do with hardware and storage hard hardware storage and they have these boxes of s hooks s, s hooks so in here you get a variety of sizes of these big metal s hooks bit very big medium and smaller ones these are great for us crafters to use on the edge of our craft carts to hang items, to hang other things. Uh, I use these all over. Uh, I, I use a lot of S hooks and we use S hooks period in, uh, in and around our, our home and our property inside and outside. So there's lots of 
different uses for these and so I thought that a box like this with the variety of uh, hooks you get a total of 15 pieces all together I thought that for four dollars that was worth it so uh, I picked up a couple boxes of these uh, the dollar stores I went to the dollar store I went to had these beads these glass beads sweet inspirations they are handmade glass beads the only colors i saw were uh this lovely green that's there were like a square bead there was this blue with polka dot there was also a blue with little flowers i didn't get those um and i i had the uh, this was inspiring me to make either some little tassels or oh well doodads to hang from from journals notebooks pocket letters yeah with for winter theme uh i have a lot of blue and white items that i collect for like winter scrapbooking and winter paper crafting so i thought these would be lovely for that and uh these i'm not sure what i'll do with them but i had to get them and the price of that is and these are only a dollar, a dollarama. My goodness, a one dollar item. It's possible to find one dollar items at Dollarama still. And this is a great stocking stuffer for the crafter, uh, that, a crafter that you know, a beater, someone who's into jewelry making. They're very nice. They're nice quality beads. So you can't go wrong with that. One thing I really needed to get uh, were these little resealable storage bags you get 72 in here for a dollar 25 this is what i use to store my little beads my diamond art beads uh this is the system i like to use the most so i just wanted to get a lot more of these bags so i could kit up all my different upcoming projects so i got that a new item uh the these packages of three deal 3d pearl paint they say they're pearl paint i bought other 3d paints a larger pack uh, and you get a lot more in the large pack for four dollars uh, but they weren't pearl paint i don't know what if they really are pearl paint i have to tell you that the packs i bought before uh the puffy paint ones uh are puffy um, I imagine they would get puffier if I applied heat. The ones with the bubble glitter ones, I don't get the bubble thing. Um, they're, they're more like a, a thick matte acrylic paint with lots of glitter in them. That's what they seem to be like. Uh, I haven't tried applying heat to the paint, but uh, they might puff up, but they're really the, the bubble glitter is, is just a paint with a lot of glitter in it. Uh, so these say pearl paint. I don't know if they really are pearly. I will have to try them at a later date. Um, but yeah, that is what I got. And these are the combinations of colors that were available at my store. There's lots of pinks that repeat them in here, but uh, yeah, that's okay. We'll see. we'll see. I could try one out right now. So uh, these make great stocking stuffers as well. Um, I have to say that the quality of the other 3D paints that I bought is nothing like, uh, someone was asking me if they were like uh, stickles. No, not at all. Not at all like stickles. Um, they're just really a craft paint. That's all I could say to you. So let me see about this one here, if I can show you. Okay, this is one of the, they, and they have no color names. Oh, it does look pearly. Okay, so coming out of the bottle, comes out like this, comes out pretty thick. I see the possibility of making like little pearls out of this. It's very pearly. Um, yeah, it's got that pearly sheen to it. So I guess it's possible. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm this you see it here <laughs> I'm just trying it live so if if you try it and you don't like the result please don't be mad at me <laughs> so there I'm just putting that aside because I don't want to get paint all over 
everything else now. Uh, I picked up a, <laughs> a neat tool and it's covered in glitter because of something else that I bought. <laughs> oh my goodness, there's glitter everywhere. I found this utensil holder, but yeah, I could, it will hold four utensils. Um, and this is a problem that I encounter when I am cooking is that I will have many utensils. I will have many pots on the stove. I will be stirring one thing. I'll be getting something from the oven and I have all these utensils and then I have a thing for my spoon rest. I have a spoon rest and then I have another plate. Oh my goodness. So I just thought uh, this might be handy. This might solve my problem of knowing how to, you know, where to put those spoons uh, when I am cooking. So this is $3.50. I only saw it in this gray, it's a silicone in this gray. So I don't know if it's available in the other colors, but I'm gonna give this a, this is going to be a stocking stuffer for uh, for Christmas for hubby, because <laughs> he's a cook too, so there we go. Don't know what to give the man anymore. So here's, here are the items that were, that caused all the glitter in my bag. I did purchase a box, uh, one of these KIS Kiss boxes for, uh, for $4. I buy a lot of these boxes for storage. And I wanted to make sure that my, my deers came home in one piece and without too much glitter fallout, like you can see. Now the how much glitter is stuck to this thing now, uh, so yeah, I I realize in the store I, I have to find a way to bring these home that won't cause damage to my other stuff and to the deer, the reindeer. So I got this box to put them in, and this reindeer I think is gorgeous. I hope you can see that. Here's my reindeer, he, it's beautiful. They have other colors, I saw it in um, silver. And I think there was a gold or a rose gold. No, it wasn't a rose gold, I can't remember now. But I love the white ones, so that's what I got. So it's a beautiful reindeer, it's $4. And it's a nice piece, it's a substantial size piece. So I got two like this. And as much as I really like the white ones, they also have these clear acrylic ones. And I just thought these are absolutely gorgeous as well. And since I couldn't decide which one I liked more, I got, I got a large one like this in a clear acrylic. It's it's heavy. It's got a lot of weight. It's just I think it looks beautiful. It's just a beautiful reindeer. Uh, this one is also four dollars, but I, I I just love it. I just think it's a beautiful piece. And I got two small ones to go with it, and the smaller ones are two dollars a piece. So uh, yeah. I'm pretty happy with, no, they're not $2, sorry. The smaller ones are $1.50. So I got the big reindeer and the younglings, the young ones. <laughs> so these will be new in my stash and collection and displays of Christmas decorations. So. There's glitter everywhere, and that's the other reason I wanted to get this video done so I could I could put everything away and then vacuum because I've got glitter and stuff all over the place. All right, next I got some decoration storage bags. These are very big and round. They say that I can put a wreath in here of 30 inches. So I hope that is true. I will be trying that after Christmas to store a couple of reefs. Uh, these are $4 a piece. I hope it works. They're not, they're soft. So that's basically like putting my wreath in a bag, but uh, I will I will test this out. And I got two of these for my two reefs that I put uh, out on our two front doors. Picked up some napkins. I just thought they were a lovely design, very vintage, -y, very vintage Christmas looking. A dollar fifty, you get eighteen. Yes, you get eighteen of these napkins, 
and I just love the distressed look of them. I will be keeping some for some paper crafts, of course. And I love the reindeer. I just, yep, yeah, I got that. There were some new quotes uh, stickers, and these are in gold. Golden stickers, quotes, golden stickers from crafts. Uh, and this one says things like, for you, wake up, kiss, pajamas all day, and be awesome. L uh, lots of sentiments on there. Also got this one. It says, oh, so amazing, young, favorite, oh, snap, take on the world, follow your heart. Um, Today, and so this, you know, these are great for... Um, planners this is great for card making um, just so many things you can do with these pretty stickers they're very thin and they will and they're clear so you only see the gold part on your paper take on the world oh that's the same one i bought two of that one there is also you are you are still the one with love so blessed 30 days of gratitude, start each day with a grateful heart, so very thankful, straight from the heart. So there's just lovely, lovely quotes. And there's another one here. Life is about the little moments. Remember what matters most. Start every day with laughter. Just some positive uh, quotes and sentiments. And this one again. So yeah, so I have... I bought like two of each, so I'm not going to show you them twice. A new item I found were the glitter and sequin pack. So you get 24 tiny packs of different glitters and different sequins. Uh, there's only one. They're, they're all the same. Each, each of these is the same. There's not different combinations. If there is, I did not see that in the store that I was at. So for $2, you get these 24 pack of glitters and different kinds of sequins. And I wanted to share that with you because I know that it's still trending to make shaker pockets and I thought, or pocket, le uh, pocket letters, uh, and these were excellent for that. I want to show you the sequins up close. I hope you can see that. These ones look like little teardrops. And there's, are those little birds? I think they're, there's like purple little birds, little stars. These are just round sequins, regular sequins. These are just like blue confetti sequins, little pink hearts, multicolored sequins, blue stars, silver circles, uh, gold stars, tiny gold stars, tiny silver stars. So, and then all these colors of glitter. So in case you uh, would like to purchase this yourself uh, to use for your own crafting or perhaps to give to someone in a gift basket, let's say. Uh, yeah, I wanted to share that with you. Not a brand new item, but I had not seen it until yesterday were the bolts of felt. So there is 42 and a half inches by 19 and a half inches of felt per bolt. They are very stiff type of felt. And I thought I would get several of the white to be able to use it for like Christmas villages. Uh, it could be snow and, you know, yeah, snow basically. So these are $1.25. I got one of the pink. I got several of the white. They had different, they had di many different colors. I didn't get all the colors because I already do have a lot of felt, but I did get black as well because that's a color that I don't have much of. So um, I got this big thing of black felt. A new item. Um, these are mini craft pliers. And I think this is a really nice stocking stuffer as well you get these tiny little pliers which are perfect for my hands because I, I have small hands four dollars you get these mini pliers a great for uh, any wire cutting mitch shaping type of craft especially if you are a uh, a jewelry maker this will come in very handy 
but as a you know general crafting uh yeah these will be handy for me as well you get a pair of round nose pliers a pair of cutters and these are the chain nose pliers so pretty handy dandy little set of pliers to have and yep my god a new item were the glitter frame boards you have these glitter frame boards for two dollars you get five of these glitter frame boards so they are like basically white cards with glitter all around the edges and you could feel like that you could feel that it's more of a frame and they come in these five packs and there's five different colored frames in each pack they are 11 by 14. so i have no idea what i'll be doing with these but i thought i should get some because yeah i don't know what i'll be doing with these <laughs> oh i also got some blue felt i forgot i got a roll of the blue felt oh the paper packs these I had not seen uh, any of my stores and finally I did yesterday. So I'm happy to have this um, color, which is foil, which is foil and like glitter paper and these pinks and purples. So, and there's no fallout from this glitter paper, which I really appreciate. So I got the pink set, the pink purple set. And there's some new papers. Uh, this is paper, paper pad, different patterns. So these are the different patterns. Um, and there's this one that is pastel marble. So it's pastels and a marble, marble style pastels. And it's, it's a nice thickness of uh, paper, thick scrapbooking paper. There's also this one, which they call Pastel Galaxy. So it's basically pastels and it's got like little splotches of white and it make it look celestial, I guess. And the wood grain. So I was pretty happy to find that one as well. Uh, wood grain, which I had not seen before. So yeah, so I have this now added to my stash of paper. And I always say I don't need more paper, but when it's in small pads like that, uh, and this is what I, you know, I'm gonna probably be using this more than larger sheets. So to me, this is a good buy. Oh, and uh, last but not least, I have two small gifts or stocking stuffers uh, that I bought for my guys. I found this notebook, and it's it's a lined notebook. It's Hall Pass, 60 pages by American Crafts. So this is one of those things. This is probably like Target stuff that is ending up at our Dollaramas. And I just got this because I thought my guys are going to love this. It's these ninjas. <laughs> it's a scene somewhere, obviously, uh, like an, either in a, a Chinatown or an Asian city or something. And you have the ninjas <laughs> throwing those stars at each other. It's just, so something I think my boys would, uh, would like. And one of my sons does love notebooks especially. So uh, I think he will actually use it. And the other thing I saw was this pad of paper. And it's a, it's a doodle. So it's kind of, you know, uh, imitating Google, I guess. And it's like when you're sending an email to someone, it's the computer what the computer screen looks like or used to look like this is it seems like an older style of emailing system so and the front cover is actually a dry erasable cover 
and inside it's a paper pad so it's all papers that look like if you're going to send an email to someone and I think the idea is to doodle to draw to draw on this so because it, it's think doodle thinking outside the lines and it's 60 sheets it's by thinkdoodle.com yeah so I just thought this would be a fun thing to give my my sons uh, I'm sure they would get a kick out of this as well and uh, you know it's paper they can always use paper to write on if they still write on paper ha <laughs> ha okay uh, so that's it for this Dollarama haul um, yeah that's that's it for this Dollarama haul that I had to share with you there were a lot of items a lot of fun things a lot of fun new things a lot of four dollar items I know but I'm, I'm quite happy with what I found I hope I've inspired you I hope I've given you some gift-giving ideas, especially for young men. <laughs> they're, I find they're really tough to buy for. Um, so, yeah, let me know in the comments how your preparations are going for the holiday seasons. And hopefully you're getting a lot more Christmas crafting done than I am. <laughs> and I hope you are well. So thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. If you like this video, I would appreciate a thumbs up. Please like, comment, share. And until next time, stay crafty. Bye.